swimmers are being warned a monster white pointer shark could still be lurking in waters off North Stradbroke Island. The predator may be six metres long. It recently mauled a smaller shark caught by a drumline. One swift bite almost cut the shark carcass in half. It certainly opened our eyes. Um, it's, I mean, it's, it's, the fish that was caught, or shark that was caught, is a, a substantial fish in itself. This three metre wide pointer was recently caught by a baited drumline off North Stradbroke Island, Cylinder Beach. Authorities believe a second shark, twice its size, caused the damage. Similar to this grey white, which claimed the life of a Perth man late last year. That cannibal thing is what great whites do. Uh, they will eat anything, including their own, their own kind. Sharks can move up to 200 kilometres in a day, but experts warn there's every chance the monster shark could still be in the area. It would be sensible not to swim in that area for some little while because obviously uh, a big shark's been there. If they're going to grab something that's as big as another shark, they're definitely going to grab something like my daughter. I actually don't think people should be in there at all. If there's one out there, then they should be pulling people back in because it's not worth taking the risk, I don't think. Queensland Fisheries says it won't be undertaking extra patrols to locate the animal. With clear evidence of a monster shark prowling waters off North Stradbroke Island, the state government says the drum lines and shark nets are here to stay. Despite the ongoing problem of young whales getting tangled in nets off the Queensland coast, five have been trapped in the past two months. Michael Scanlon, 